The star and executive producer of The Connors, the hit ABC sitcom. It's the first broadcast comedy, comedy to be back in production since the pandemic. And there she is. Let's say good morning to Miss Sarah Gilbert. Hello with the wave. It's good to see you. And we want to start by putting up a picture now of the cast uh, back together. Uh, and certainly things are different now. Everybody's wearing a mask with that iconic uh, couch pattern on it. Um, what was it like? What is it like to finally be back together given all that's been going on the past several months? Well, it's wild, you know, to you spend five months not seeing anybody and then to be around people you love. I feel grateful that we get to come into work every day. It's definitely different. There's a lot of masks and a lot of space and it's not exactly the same, but I do feel very lucky. I'm sure people relate, you know, it's it's hard to stay home and not have any of your routines, not see your loved ones, things like that. So so definitely it's been a lot of fun. Yeah, Sarah, TJ mentioned right at the beginning that you guys are the first broadcast comedy series to get back to work. You mentioned the math, you mentioned the space. What are, what are some of the biggest changes uh, that you guys have going on on set there? Well, I would say definitely the masks and, and the spacing, and then there's a lot of ventilation. You can see the there's different zones. You can see that, like where which people are allowed to be in which zone, a lot of face shields. We even do run-throughs and all that with masks, so only for a few minutes when we shoot do we ever take the masks off, and even then we're generally pretty spaced out. Um, and, you know, a lot of testing, testing of cast and crew several times a week. It's pretty extensive. Was it a tough decision to go back? Uh, it was really involved a lot of people and a lot of health experts and things like that. And um, I think no decision is being taken lightly right now. And I think everybody, no matter who we are, are sort of weighing out what we can do and can't do and what feels safe. I think, you know, we're so lucky that there's people keeping us safe and looking at protocols and all that because it is, you know, a bigger number of people coming together. Does it, did it change your storyline? Everything that's happening in the world now, does it change some of the writing? Is this being incorporated uh, into the show? Yeah, definitely we wanna reflect what's going on. I think people look to, when they come to watch our show, they wanna see some version of what's happening in the world or in their lives and, I think it would be strange to just be sitting at a restaurant with a group of people in a scene when that's not what's happening in the world. So, you know, we're definitely trying to balance that with, there's also some fatigue. People probably also want to break to some degree and not to always be hearing about the pandemic and what's going on. And so it's, there are storylines that touch on it. It affects each of our lives in terms of our livelihood, the way it's affecting many people. But um, we also have a lot of storylines that aren't related and you, you see masks and you see things like that, but it's not always front and center of every storyline. Well, we know you guys don't, don't shy away from the tough topics, so we are really looking forward to this season. Sarah, thank you so much. The Connors returns so Wednesdays this fall right here on ABC. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.